The HyperTouch table is a multi-touch surface developed by Kevin Ponto in the visualization lab of Professor Falco Kuster in collaboration with UC San Diego Center of Interdisciplinary Science for Art, Architecture and Archaeology and its director, Maurizio Saracini. It puts versatile interactive visualization at the viewer's fingertips, literally, permitting exploration of artworks in great detail, not only on the surface, but what lies beneath the surface. After a complete diagnostic survey of Leonardo da Vinci's Adoration of the Magi, the multispectral images were uploaded to the HyperTouch table, allowing anyone to explore the masterpiece's state of conservation and the techniques that Leonardo used. Pressing fingers on the surface can reveal the back of the wood panel. Then the X-ray can appear. Then fluorescence generated by ultraviolet light, which can uncover stray dust on the surface of a painting. And in this case, infrared light uncovering the true masterpiece, Leonardo's underdrawing, not seen in nearly 500 years. The detailed preparatory drawing was covered over with brownish paint, likely by another artist, as indicated by pseudocolor infrared imaging and other tests. Under that brownish coat, now visible to anyone who can wipe away the past, are stunning secrets, like the previously invisible workman depicted rebuilding a pagan temple. Also hidden for half a millennium, one of the most spectacular collections of faces ever drawn by da Vinci. Now imagine putting the hypertouch table at the fingertips of medical students. This is a volumetric rendering of the CAT scan of a human head. It can be moved around, enlarged, and with just their fingers, students can explore the inside of the skull. The harder you press, the deeper you go, just by rubbing the skin down to the skull, reaching the eye sockets or lips giving way to show teeth. Many other wavelengths could be added, making the multi-touch table a powerful tool for learning and for discovery in medicine, in art conservation, and conceivably in many other fields as well. In other words, a fitting tool that would make Leonardo da Vinci the true Renaissance man very proud.